Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in the final station. As you can see, we are starting a new game today. It's a little bit of an older game. came out in 2016, so it's coming up on five years old. Let's see what Steam says. August 30th, 2016. So, yeah, coming up on five years old. This is a pixel post-apocalyptic survival game. And you travel around a country on a, a train trying to survive. So let's go ahead and hop on in and uh, see what is awaiting us in the final station. Alright, so here we are with our little guy. And looks like we can... Oops, we just shot. Uh, there we go. E is to open. Let's go ahead and... R, yep, R reloads. And we'll do that. Down some stairs. I don't know where we are. Are we like in a sewer or something? Some sort of basement? Okay, oop, here we go. Here's our first zombie. Headshots for the win, apparently. Uh, we can loot this person. Pistol ammo and cigarettes. Very nice. Little guy and a big guy. And there we go. They both fall down dead from our pistol. We got a hatch and a door we can go through. And the door brings us to here. And what is this? Some sort of cult meeting. We got the moon outside and some symbols on the wall. A lot of people. Can't interact with any of them. Let's go over here. So it looks like we can... Fall down here? No, it's not letting me fall down. Do I jump down? No. Alright, let's go around this way. I'm guessing we can only come up that way. Let's go to the hatch here and we'll open the hatch. Looks like we got a friend down here and we will shoot him to death. Alright, let's go through this door. Uh, guy off a shotgun down there. Uh, looks like a sleeping... Oh, prison cells. Okay, so we're in an underground prison with a weird church. Yet no one has said anything yet. Uh, all right, there's a hatch there. Let's go through this door. There's a hatch there. There's a door here. Another stairwell. Okay, so W and S to take ladders. And looks like we are outside uh, fishing. Someone was fishing out here, it looks like. Some pistol ammo from them. Beautiful little uh, lakeside area. The dead body next to it. All right, let's... Oops. Through that door, we got... Drop those guys before they get us. So far, no one's damaged us, so that's good. All right, and there's that. So back up this ladder and through this hatch. So it looks like we have to go through this hatch. Yeah, that's the only thing left to go through. Ooh, down a long, scary ladder into the darkness. Let's see what... Oh, there's a lot of people here, and we died very, very fast. That is not good, not good at all. Uh, 106 years since the first visitation. There's an alarm going off in the background. Guessing this is us, and maybe that was a dream of some sorts, or a premonition. I have no clue. And we're up. Alright, so is there anything we can loot in here? Because, you know, you always got to loot your own apartment. Alright, and let's see over here. Our bathroom. Into our toilet room. Alright, nope, wait, there we go. We can loot our cabinet for some soap and coins. We are rich down the ladder. It looks like we can go out only that door. All right, so we're going to go out this door into our kitchen. Oop, loot the fridge. Got to get food. There we go. And outside, and away we go. I'm going to so we can get stuff from the mailbox. All citizens age 16 and over must attend the annual second visitation drill at the local response center. Next drill is scheduled for Friday. Administration of the Armand White. All right, I wonder if today's Friday and we're going to go join our... Uh, Join the uh, party. Alright, what's this say? Koopa? Kaupa? Some sort of store? What do you have to say, friend? Hello. You're early today. Martin is not here today. Disappeared somewhere. All I know. Had to come here and work his hours. Oh, that stinks, my friend. Any latches? Nope. Yeah. Oh, there's a hatch. Here we go. I wonder if this is Martin here. Loot the box. Whiskey and cigarettes. Wake up, Martin. Nope, I'm assuming he's passed out drunk. Got himself a little bit of too much whiskey and fell asleep in the basement by the dumpster with all the flies. If you've been enjoying the game so far, or if you've played it uh, previously, let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on the final station. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, obviously. Wanted. Four guardian construction engineers, mechanics, and builders are wanted. 10 years minimal experience required. Sounds like the real world. Uh, metropolitan lower sector accommodation meals, double pensions are provided. Ad does not apply 
to settler families. So it sounds like we have some political strife in our area as well. Okay, we can go through that door up here. We got our friend smoking his cigarette. Get ourselves some toilet paper for three bucks. What do you got? Oh, hello. Vacation is over, I see. The boss isn't here today, so there is no need to hurry. Well, ain't that the truth. When the boss is not around, everyone will dally. All right, into the locker rooms. Let's loot some of these lockers. Some screws and rags. And I'm assuming this is our locker. Let's put our uniform on, I guess. There we go. We are all decked out with our hat and uh, vest and some black pants and ready to, to rule the world, I guess. Oh, guess I have locked the door by accident. I didn't peek at all. Is she a perv looking at us? I guess, maybe. All right. Are you sure there is a good, or this is a good idea? He's not the best train operator. What if something goes wrong? Calm down. I'll keep an eye on him. James, this is a very important train. I know. Are they talking about us? They must be. Up into the control tower. Get some clothing. Uh, Metropole Upper House to Paul Anderson, head of Burfruit, Burtfruit Station. Blocker code combination 6683. Okay, so... We found some sort of code back down the ladder. Anything else in here? And let's talk to this fellow here. Hello. While you're away, they have installed new blockers. What are our blockers? Boss left at the code in his office. Type it in the panel by the train. I will fill you in as we travel. Okay, well, we got the blocker code. I'm guessing this unlocks our train and allows us to travel. There's our, our beautiful train, the Bellus 07. All right, is this the... Yep, okay, this must be the blocker here. Let's go ahead and add the code, 668383. And it's a green light, so we should be good to go. And it looks like we're going to hop on the train. Very nice indeed. And we're unlocked from the blocker. And just like that, we can continue on our travels. Nice train sound. All right, medkit, food... Okay, interact with that. Okay, battery using 20 volt, 35 volt, 36 volt. Looks like we got a chat panel as well. Uh, crafting system. And ooh, this is quite a map. And we're traveling from Redmond, rural town in the northern parts. Its only landmark is the old president's residence built in the last century. Okay, so we're going from Redmark to Nimlard. Small provincial power house where people from neighboring areas come for shopping. Praxi agency has their headquarters here. All right, so nice little train trip. We can back out of that. Food, med kit, uh, let's see, what is this? Uh, the vent system, I didn't catch what he said. This is an experimental model. There are frequent operational failures. You will need to set it up manually. If it overheats, it won't be able to move. Okay, that's good to know. What else do you have to say, my friend? All right, Irving Jones, a reward of $250. And, uh oh, got a red thing over here. So this must be the overheat. And do we just have to pump this down like this? Uh, okay, we got to pump it multiple times, it looks like. We have to take it all the way down. Yep, take it all the way down. All right, an important order from the board. It takes a full day to get there and another day back. Of uh, Double overtime fare. Sounds great to me. Sounds like we're making a little bit of money while we're doing this. And along the train we go. Urban Jones, you lost a little bit of health and you're kind of hungry. Oh yeah, the blockers. Looks like we have arrived. You remember the accident at Exiler 5? It was horrible. Sure thing, the council couldn't let this slip. Now in order to leave a station, I'm guessing you will need to get an access code from the station manager. Sounds sensible. But what if the station manager is sick? Or something else has happened. Do I need to get you food? All right, let's get some food here. And we're going to give you the food. There we go. Now you're no longer hungry, Irvin Jones, assistant engineer. All right, so we have arrived. So let's go ahead and, I guess, go into the station there. There we go. Very nice. Pulling on in. And we're going to hop off our little train. There's the blocker we'll have to unlock if we want to leave. And, yep, we need the code there. What do you have to say, my friend? You are late. 
That's not very nice. There's no express train today. We'll have to take this wreck of a train. Yeah, yeah, you will. So get your butt on the train, and we will get you to where we need to go. Hello? How's your vacation? I see. I don't have the blocker code. The boss has it. I'm assuming the boss is up here. He's out for lunch. You can wait here or look for him in the city. Well, of course we're going to go look for him in the city. I'm sure he's close by. And what do you have to say? With these new blockers, there's twice as much work to do. Sounds like a bureaucracy. Oh, the idiots in the government. All right, let's go ahead and up. Oh, that's locked. Anything we can take off his desk? Nope. All right, well, let's go find the boss in the city. AFT, whatever that means. Some shopping carts. I'm assuming this is some sort of store. Yep, people checking out. We got aisle A, B, and C. Nothing we can uh, loot from there. Okay, through all that. Let's go up the ladder. See if we can get anything up here. Hello, not now. Okay, that's not very nice. I just want to talk and say hi. Looks like this is the office manager or store manager's office. I am off today. The new cashier is awful. Get rid of him and find a new one. Into the bathroom where we're going to steal some glasses for $6. Very nice. All right, back down the ladder. Um, can we go through the hatch? Nope, not through the hatch. Into... A little store, another little store, or someone's apartment. Okay, great. We're breaking and entering. There are communication problems on the West Coast. The area next to the border of the first contact are unresponsive. We are awaiting the details. Sounds like something's about to go down. Uh, someone's sleeping in their apartment. Can't loot anything here. All the way up to the third floor. Um, one, get up at 640. Drink a quart of milk. Run five miles. Repeat every day. That just sounds miserable. I would never drink milk and then run. I feel like I'd be vomiting all over the place. If you've done that, let me know in the comments below how well that went. I'm guessing it didn't go well at all. Yes. Why are you distracting me, sir? Because I can. All right. Through a little office complex, it looks like. And looks like we got to go all the way up these ladders. Ah, that one's broken. It's going through this door. Uh, I couldn't find approach to Adam... He just likes his father. He's just like his father. What do we do now? We need to find a do detour. I know it's a big bulk, but if we can transfer it out of Bristol, we are set for life. Sounds like they're uh, doing some sort of shady deal. Maybe something in the future we'll have to deal with. Big old steam, uh, not a big old uh, exhaust thing over there, or some sort of uh, chimney. All right, what do you have to say? Oh, nom. Okay, so someone's eating his lunch. Sorry, your train has slipped my mind. Could you take the key from my suitcase? Code blank is in the locker, but don't steal anything, okay? Yes, you are right. I am sorry. Okay, so that was the, the station conductor. We got the key. What do we got back here? Hey, friend, need your help. Could you stretch a coin for my beer? Yeah, well, it's up to you. Streets are dangerous at night. Keep your head down, or something might just fall on you. Well, that's good to know as well. Can I give him a coin? I guess not. V, whatever that stands for. Let's go down this hatch and see what we can find. Slide down the ladder. All right, looks like we got some sewer vents down here into the parking garage for this place. What do you have to... What the hell? Oh, that's it? Okay. I wonder if he's is he just smoking a cigarette. Yeah. And we can steal whiskey and wires from this car. All right, into whatever this is, and another guy down here. I came here from Morganstern to find these two screws unscrewed. Okay, so he must be a repair technician lost about his way. And okay, there we go. That's how we open that hatch. And back into the little store, and nothing has changed in there. Everyone's still trying to check out. Let's go unlock that locker so we can leave to the next station. Up the ladder here. All right, Metropole Upper House to Richard Rogers, head of Nimlard Station. Blocker code confirmation 5743. Okay, and back down. Oh, wait, that was still lit up. Oh, okay, that's just that. And back out to our little blocker here. And we will put in the 5743 code. Beautiful. Now we can leave and head to our next uh, destination. And there we go, the train unlocks. And chugga chugga choo choo, off to, we'll have to see on the map here where we're going to next. Ah, we picked up that other guy, another passenger, very nice. 
All right, where is our map? So we are heading from Nimlard back to uh, Central Station Keskus. Central Railway Hub always has trains scheduled to and from all destinations. Station building was commissioned before the first visitation and is a cultural heritage site. Ah, very nice. So we uh, will be heading there, it looks like. Let's go back here and talk to our passengers. Yeah, it's even worse inside. Is there a problem, sir? Problem? Yes. Yes, I have a problem. You are adding more problems. What? Uh, I'm afraid I don't understand. Damn scheduled train, where is it? Taking it sweets time. Uh, okay, so we need to adjust this. Um, I gotta decrease this, I guess. There we go, okay, done. Skate engine hasn't changed in the tw 20 years. Yes, I know, because I've been taking it for 20 years. So then what's your issue, friend? Dot, dot, dot. Those idiots on the station told me they can't reach the train driver. How could that happen? I'm afraid I don't know. I bet you don't. You guys are some slow talkers, I'll tell you that. All right, let's see what this message has for us. Ah, looks like we have a chat um, from Peter Wright, or White. Uh, hi, welcome back. Thank you much. No planned route changes. However, there are communication problems in the south. I hope the team can fix this. Me too. Peter is offline. Okay, so it sounds like we're kind of getting, uh, you know, an idea that there's some issue going on somewhere across the country. Uh, have you heard, Trevor, oh, that went over that. Does anyone have food? Okay, so he wants some food, so let's go ahead and get this. And we will feed you. Thanks. Uh, but I never reached the final station. Ah, there's the name of the game. People often disappear in the west, but uh, west there is a borderline. But trains, now the scheduled train is gone. You guys are some slow talkers. All right, let's go ahead and bring the station, or the train into the station. And here we are at the central station. Let's see what this has to offer. Ah, quite a few trains in the background. And we're gonna go ahead and hop off. And let's, uh, let's head, oops, we can loot that trash can for a couple of rags. I'm assuming you use rags to make medical kits, I, I don't know. Some paper we can read here. I need to leave, Michael has some troubles with the patrol, Amanda. Uh-oh. Uh, can we loot your locker, train driver, uniform, six bucks, cigarettes, four bucks. All right, hello. The code? Oh yeah, the code. There was a manual somewhere on how to print it. Will you just stand here? Give me some time and take a walk around. All right, so I'm guessing it wants us to go explore the map. Uh-oh, we got some uh, security guards or something? Let's see what this guy has to say. Through the scanner, faster. Yes, sir. All right, and into, I'm assuming, here we go. This is the central station. Listen, they canceled all the tickets to the south, but I need to get back home. It is important. I will pay. Money is no issue. Thank you. So, looks like we got ourselves another passenger. Uh, what do we got this group of guys over here? No details still. Any word from the council? I think they're already evacuated. Nonsense. Alright, so something's happening, guys. And I'm guessing we're going to find out very soon. As the story starts to pick up here. How are we going to get there? What? No, we need to go north. Okay, so they don't want to ride in our train. Uh, looks like this guy sells food. Yeah, we can buy food, buy and sell food, for 50 bucks a unit. Let's go ahead and exit for now. And, okay, here's the ticket booth. See what we got going on up here in the, the ticket booth. Uh, I have repeat, ticket office is closed. Yes, all destinations. All right, so it sounds like none of the trains are running anymore for whatever reason that is lurking in the background. Into the cafe. Looks like we can buy more food here. Let's see what we got upstairs. Little bathroom, some coins and soap. Garson, uh, can you ask the kitchen where my meat is? All right, we are not your waitor. I am sorry. Uh, good afternoon. Are you ready with your order? 
No, we don't serve that. Sorry. And jerk. All right, what's the... Did you order that damn triple seared steak? Working on it for hours now. Didn't know it took that long to cook a steak. But whatever. All right, so we can go down there. It looks like there's a little rat running along. Open these. Hello, man with the birds. No, I'm not going anywhere. All right, you can just sit there, friend. You can stay out in the rain. Can I talk to you again? No one listens to me at home. But think about this, young man. If we have the guardian who is meant to save us in case of second visitation, then why does council build those giant underground shelters? I don't know. We'll have to find out. So let's go see what this rat has to say. We're going to chase it out. Nope, oh, it's going to run that way now, too. All right, into a little storage room. Loot this box. Clothing, workwear. Open that hatch, and we are now in the vent system. Back down, and... Uh oh this guy looks injured. What's up, my friend? Hush. Tell no one, okay? Something happened here. Do not trust the military. Oh, okay. If you say so. A little storage room again. Uh-oh. Looks like we're about to walk into a military prison we're not supposed to know is here. Come in, faster. Uh, okay. Haven't been arrested yet. Looks like they're uh, searching some people. Searching their luggage. Ooh, that guy got shot dead. Halt! What are you doing here? You're a railway worker. Your authority is limited to railway. If I see you hanging around here again, you'll join that one. Is he just threatening to kill us? All right, let's get the heck out of here before we get shot again. Um, okay, so the military may or may not be uh, friendly to us. That's good to know. Let's go ahead and back out this way, and hopefully that station manager is ready for us so we can uh, get out of here. I'm guessing that's the code there. I've printed out the code. Hope it's all right. Where is Amanda? Uh, she said she took off to go help. Uh, is it Michael? All right, upper house code um, 6442. All right, let's go ahead and hop on down. And we are going to go over here. And before we put that code in, let's go ahead and call that an episode. Thank you guys so much for coming out. Don't forget to like the video if you have enjoyed the first, uh, I guess we'll call it three stops along the way for the final station. Comment on down below if you have played the game before. Let me know your thoughts on it. Uh, you know, what you liked, what you don't like about it. And I've, I've enjoyed it so far. Nice little game. We haven't gotten to any action yet other than that opening dream sequence. And if you don't mind, please don't forget to like and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get this great content on time and in an orderly fashion. Thank you so much for joining me today, and we'll see you in the next Final Station video.